Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to check out my fashion. Today's video is a get ready with me. I'm experimenting with new makeup. I got new foundation and I got two new lip glosses from the NYX Butter Gloss. I think this is these are two colors from their new line. So I'm trying out these colors. Also got a trim. So I wanted to see how it looked when I like got all like put together. So I got a trim. It's like it's shorter. Like it, it really is shorter. I think I in between me getting my relaxers and in between me trying new things in my hair that's never gonna stop something happened and my hair was breaking off like not breaking off actually it was breaking off and it was coming out to the point where when I combed my hair I felt hair on my arms and on my legs and by the time I got up there was hair on the floor so it was a journey so before I could I got my relaxer two weeks ago I got my relaxer after Thanksgiving so um before that, I, I we didn't want to relax my hair right away, so I got a deep condition, and I had to wait. And during the waiting, my hair was falling out less, but it was still falling out. But it was falling out less. I didn't want to just relax my hair while it was in the state of, like, coming out and breaking off. So we had to do a treatment, me and my stylist. We had to do a treatment, wait, let it take a little bit, and... It was coming out less, so that was good. When I got my relaxer, my hair took really well. It grew, and it was my hair was coming out less, but then we also decided to wait. So I waited again, got a deep condition, waited, and then by the time like we thought it was a good time to trim and see how much hair was lost overall, this is what I came out with. Um, very shoulder length, like extremely, extremely shoulder length hair. And I'm not mad at it. Like I love when my hair could flip up and do that little doo-wop thing. I love when my hair is like doing this right now. So I'm really happy with it. Length, yes, is important to me. But my number one thing is like my hair looking cute. So if it's cute and it's healthy, I'm straight. Like, this is what happened. I like this length. I think that I just want to keep my hair this length because when it gets too long, I find that I can't do cute things with it. Like I can't flip it up like this and it just gets so like, I don't know, it kind of looks plain. But I like this. I like this length. I like the volume that I get from this. So um, that is the quick hair update. I think soon I'm gonna be getting some box braids and I will also I also have this wig that I'm definitely going to come on here and show you guys how I put on my wigs so that should be fun because it has some color in it so that's fun also soon I know my channel has been really like hair and makeup related recently and I am gonna be doing a styling video coming back with a how to style your doc martens video i've been practicing it's not like i you know am just like not doing it i'm practicing like i have to practice how to wear these before i come on here and be like oh how to style your doc martens you know what i mean enjoy today's video thank you for watching my other videos thank you for coming back to check out my fashion and i will see you next video
I don't want them back, never give them back to me. I just want to show you guys, look at how many sets of lashes were in my car. Just in the glove compartment because once I'm done with the night, I just take them off in the car. I just can't. I took my sweater off because um, I do want to wear it, but it's kind of dark for this whole scene right now. So I just took it off and like on my way out, I'll just put it on. But honey, I went to NYX again. I'm on the quest since they don't sell cinnamon roll anymore. The um From the butter glosses, they don't sell cinnamon roll anymore so I am on the hunt for the perfect nude lip gloss like of course I got Madeline again because I ran out so I got Madeline again I will never stop getting Madeline as long as they sell it so I got Madeline but then I ran I came across oh my nose is running Fuck, I'm too excited uh. I have a hard time finding my shade in foundations as well and also as you guys saw the title of the video obviously but I'm trying out some new products so I tried out this elf um, foundation in the color spice and I think you know it's really not bad like I think it's a good foundation but the thing is, like, I really, like, my pigmentation is, it's not off, but it's, like, under my eyes, like, from my eyes up, it's a whole different shade from my under eyes down. So, when I'm looking for foundation, I kind of, since the majority of my face is one color, and, you know, the rest I could deal with, I kind of want to match my foundation when I bring it up 
that it'll match the upper half of my face. Was I just looking at the viewfinder the entire time? Wow. But um, it's hard for me to find foundation that matches. So I don't know if I'm... S I know in the summer I get super dark skin, team dark skin all the way. But like in the summer, in the winter, especially if I'm on my BS and I do not leave my house, it gets pretty like, you know, like gray and light. So um, I just tried Spice. Like this is in the sunlight. You can see how... It's not the lightest of shades, and I think the sunlight is making it look even more light than it is. So I tried Spice. I like it. I like it. It says Flawless Finish Foundation. I do feel like, you know, it's giving me, like, that flawless finish. And then when I was done, I didn't even have to blend it into my scalp, so that's good. So I think I, think I like this foundation. Like, obviously, I'm going to be looking for, like, better foundations, new foundations, but... I do like this foundation like this is something I feel comfortable in um, I was using the born to glow NYX um, foundation it's naturally radiant and it's in the color what color is this cappuccino and if you compare the two the elf foundation is just like a shade darker than the NYX foundation. So that's that. I thought that, you know, it was a game. I'm just getting really close because I'm about to try these on. I thought that it was a game when um, NYX came out with cinnamon roll and I never went and I you know I saw the post and I was like all right I'll get to it I'll get to it or whatever I never got to it and they don't make it anymore so I found these new this is from I don't know these were 40% off at the store but I think it's part of the new shades or they might be old shades I don't know but Eclair and Sunday Mimosa Mimosa du Dimanche. Sunday Mimosa, Mimosa de Dimanche. Sunday Mimosa, Mimosa de Dimanche. So it's in English and then it's in French again. Clever. So, um, Madeline. Madeline, we already know, looks amazing on the brown skin girls. Madeline looks amazing on the dark skin girls. That we already know. Now, let's try. I tried Eclair in the store, and I liked it. I really liked it. Like, I really liked Eclair. So, let me get this open. So, here's Eclair. That is gorgeous. That is really pretty. That is like really pretty. Let me back up so you guys. Well, actually, let me. Like, you could see how like it's it's sheer, so it's not too intense, but like see you see, this is like yes. It's the kind of color that's like a it's sheer, but it's kind of like glassy, and it has this kind of like bluish look to it. It's, it kind of looks like, like an opal kind of like sheer, but it has like all these undertones of like a blue and like a beige, and I love it. I think it looks amazing. Like, this is why, this is why I bought Eclair. Like, it just looks like... Perfect. I don't know. It looks like absolutely perfect. I really like this color. I think this color would look good on any dark skin girl. Like any dark skin girl, brown skin girl, I feel like this color would look amazing on. Because like it just, it elevates. So that's Eclair. Now this is Sunday Mimosa, Mimosa de Dimanche. And 
and I didn't try this on in the store but it kind of it looks like a good nude for my skin complexion like for brown skin girls so let me try that I hope it looks good like I don't know I just bought it so if it doesn't I'll probably just like I don't know see if it looks good on my mom give it a mix you guys don't see what I see right now um it's not sheer. Whoa, it's it's not sheer. Oh. So this color didn't go as planned. Like it just brings the 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 tone down. You know, it's not what I thought is too pink, like let me see if you can see it on my phone better. But it's just too... Like, it's too white. Like, this would be... This would look... This would look bomb as F on a pale girl. Like, a pale girl or a light skin girl. But just, it doesn't look good on me. And I'm fine with that, but damn... But pale girls and light skin girls, I recommend that you get Sunday Mimosa. I think this would look amazing on a pale girl or a light skin girl.